Hey guys, today I'm going to begin um, teaching CIFO uh, crunches. And um, this is one that takes a lot of patience. And I'm basically trying to cause an environment where he will on his own um, tuck his hips or his pelvis and lift his back. Um, kind of like the belly lifts, but I'm teaching him to do them on his own. Um, which again creates a more genuine movement pattern. Um, so in the beginning, every horse is different um, and this is one way to do it. I'm sure there's lots of other different ways, but I've never done this with him. So we will see where we get. Some horses it takes several days or several weeks. Some pick it up pretty quick. Um, so the first thing I'm gonna do is um, he just backed up on his own, but using my body language without touching him, what I want to try and do is influence him to step back. And so I'm just kind of stepping back and kind of leaning back and thinking, step back, lean back, and any movement in that direction, I'm reinforcing. Even if it's only slight, even if it's just a lean, um, if they get really stuck, sometimes you just want to reinforce any uh, weight shift or any movement just to get them to try things because this is all about him just trying stuff and me reinforcing um, the things that I like kind of like playing that game where you say you're getting warmer you're getting warmer um, that kind of thing so what I want him to do is back his butt up into the wall which will cause him to tuck his hips and lift his belly and then I'll reinforce that and then eventually I can do it without the wall so that was a baby shift towards backing up. Um, and I like to use the word lift when I work with my horses. So that was a little shift. Again, in the beginning, you're not gonna see a whole lot. It's gonna look like I'm just reinforcing him for standing here. Um, but I'm really just looking for subtle, subtle changes. Lift, good, that was a shift backwards, lift. And I'm just kind of using my body language to suggest that he shift backwards. That was good. Lift. 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 And again, a lot of this is just a waiting game. It's really boring to watch, which is probably why there aren't a ton of these videos on YouTube. But this is the reality of it. Lift. Come on, Sifo. Lift. 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 There we, we got something. I saw his back muscle flex just a little bit. Lift. Lift. That was a nice shift in the correct direction. Lift, lift, lift. That was really good. That was really close to what I wanted. Lift, good, even better. Good, so now that he's actually touching the back wall, as he shifts back, you'll, you'll start to see him tuck his pelvis a little bit and lift through his spine. Lift. Ah, look at that. This is seriously our first session. I normally don't get this um, this early on, so I'm really pleased. He's a pretty intuitive guy though, so I shouldn't be surprised. Lift. That was just a tiny shift. Lift. 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 Good, another tiny shift. 
And again, in the beginning, there's no wrong time to reinforce. Um, Be really boring and really frustrating in the beginning. Um, but if you stay at it 10 minutes a day for a week, um, you'll usually get something that looks like a crunch. Um, and then you can continue to go from there. Lift, come up there, lift. And just because we got one really good one earlier doesn't mean that that's the standard I'm going to continue to hold him to. Um, you want to just continue anything that's headed the right direction. Just like I'm saying, warmer, warmer, warmer. Lift, Tifo, lift. And if you get to a point where they're just not offering you anything new, that might be a great time to just end your session and try again next time. Lift. Good. Got a little tiny shift there. Lift. Lift. Good. Lift. He does better when I'm standing in front of him, but I can't see his hind end. Lift. Tiny little weight shifts. Lift. Lift. He might be done for the day, so we're going to call it a day. I'm just going to give him a handful of treats in his bucket to thank him for um, bearing with me for that. Um, if you can do this, it's over here, bud. Uh, if you can work on this kind of thing for five or ten minutes a day for a couple weeks, um, you will see some results. It's really slow in the beginning. Just be patient. Stay with it. Don't get frustrated and reward a lot, and you will get there. Thanks for watching.